Health Info Talk provides health and medical information that is quality assured, reliable, up to date and easy to understand. Receding gums, as the name itself suggests, occurs when the gum tissue around your teeth wear away and the gums seem to recede backwards making a larger area of the surface of tooth more visible. When your gums recede, it gives rise to gape between your teeth and gum line. This makes it easy for bacteria to build up and survive there. If you do not contain receding gums, even the root of teeth may become exposed which can then cause pain making your teeth extremely sensitive. Not only this, due to the damage caused to the supporting tissue and bone structures of your teeth, you may eventually lose teeth. <music> Symptoms of receding gums Although gum recession is a very general dental problem, most of the people suffering from it doesn't seem to notice it timely because the process is very slow and it occurs gradually. However, if your tooth has become sensitive, you should check for receding gums because this one of the very first signs of receding gums. Also when you feel your tooth or teeth appear to be larger than earlier, immediately start treating your tooth as this is nothing but a receding gum problem. You can list the symptoms of receding gums as follows. Causes of receding gums Receding gums often indicate some gum disease. However, there are many more other causes of receding gums as listed here. 1. Gum diseases, specifically speaking periodontal diseases meaning bacterial infections that occur in your gums. These infections damage the gum tissue and your teeth supporting bone leading to gum recession and then other problems. Two, poor oral hygiene. If you do not brush or floss properly, you may end up building plaque on your teeth. This plaque then turns into calculus, also called tartar. Tartar is the hard substance between your teeth and may cause gum recession. Three, brushing teeth aggressively. Yes. This is contrary to the previous cause which says if you don't brush properly, you may get receding gums. In fact, if you brush your teeth aggressively, then also you may get receding gums. This is because such an aggressive act wears away the enamel present on your teeth. This in turn makes the gums recede. Four. Hormonal changes, especially in women, may also sometimes cause receding gums. The changes in hormones make the gums more sensitive and vulnerable. 5. Smoking not only causes various diseases including cancer and lung diseases but also receding gums. Those who consume tobacco in any form are prone to have sticky plaque on their teeth. This leads to gum recession. 5. How can receding gums grow back? Gums are nothing else but soft tissues that cover the bones supporting your teeth so that they may remain in place. These tissues also cover the roots of your teeth. Due to many causes discussed above the gums recede to expose your teeth and its root. Proper dental hygiene, diet and certain home remedies like oil pulling can help your receding gums grow back. We will discuss such remedies in the coming sections of this article. Natural home remedies for receding gums Here are certain remedies that use simple kitchen ingredients and sometimes herbs and spices etc. to treat and grow back your receding gums. Green tea for receding gums The health benefits of green tea are many. You can add treatment of receding gums to this too. As it is well known, 
Green tea has loads of antioxidants that keep away many diseases by combating free radicals. Free radicals in your mouth can cause periodontal disease that may lead to receding gums. Green tea has catechins, an antioxidant that helps combat area the existing periodontal disease. These catechins in your green tea will strengthen the bond between your gums and teeth. Natural Home Remedies for Receding Gums Here are certain remedies that use simple kitchen ingredients and sometimes herbs and spices etc. to treat and grow back your receding gums. Oil Pulling with Sesame Oil To treat receding gums oil pulling is one of the most effective traditional treatments for various oral diseases. Especially famous for healing cavities, oil pulling can even prevent and reverse receding gums. The anti-inflammatory and many other properties of sesame oil helps remove toxic elements from your mouth along with reducing plaque buildup. As mentioned earlier too, plaque buildup may contribute to receding gums in a major way. Sesame oil provides a protective coating over your teeth that prevent plaque from building there. Ayurveda recommends oil pulling not only for curing many oral diseases but also for better absorption of nutrients in your body. Oil Pulling with Coconut Oil to Treat Receding Gums Coconut oil has excellent antimicrobial properties and thus you may rest assured that it will immensely help you in preventing and treating any infection that is present in your mouth. As you now know that bacterial and other oral infections do cause gum recession, coconut oil can be a good remedy to combat it. Not only does it prevent tooth decay and heal cavity, coconut oil pulling is capable of treating almost all the gum issues including receding gums. Eucalyptus for receding gums. The essential oils have all the essential properties of the herbs they are made up of. In fact, their strength is much more than the actual herbs. That's why only a couple of drops of essential oils are enough to cure a condition like eucalyptus oil that cures receding gums. It is an effective germicide and thus kills all the germs in your mouth to protect you from oral diseases that lead to gum recession. Due to its anti-inflammatory properties. It also reduces the swelling in your gums. However, never apply it undiluted as it is too strong for the soft tissue of your gums. <music> Tips to prevent gum recession. Prevention is always better than cure, goes the old saying. Looking at the increasing instance of receding gums in more and more people, it seems useful to take precaution and start taking care of your oral health. This not only prevents receding gums but other oral diseases too. But how to take proper care of your gums and teeth co that you are saved against periodontal diseases. Here are some tips for the same, for preventing gum recession and for proper oral care. Maintain proper oral hygiene You should take proper care of your mouth to not only prevent gum recession but also to prevent any other kind of oral disease. Never brush aggressively. Whenever brushing, do it with gentle strokes and in circular motion. Never push your gums upwards while brushing. Brush them along your gum lines. Don't use too large a toothbrush. A brush having a small head and soft bristle is ideal for your mouth. Don't forget to floss as it is essential for removing plaque. 